Hi, my name is Caleb. Um, today I'm going to be showing you the rhythm tab to the intro of Enter Sandman. Uh, for this video at least, but uh, there will be an annotation at the near the end of the video uh, that brings you with a link to the second video I made that has the rhythm and lead to the main part of the song. So. Just click the annotation at the end if you want to keep learning. For now, I'm just going to play the intro on acoustic. I'll bring out my electric in the second video and show you the the other part. So, here goes. Okay, so to start, you're going to... You're gonna, I start off with my finger already on the 7th fret, but you're going to put your finger on the 7th fret of the A string. Hit an open E string, bottom lowest string. Hit the next string, the A string with the seventh fret. Then move your index finger up to the to the D string on the fifth fret. Then back down on the E string, you're gonna hit with your middle and index finger on the on the sixth fret, fifth fret. Then right before you start again, you're going to hit the 7th fret of the A string. So I'm just going to play it through four times so you can get the idea. So it goes... It's really simple. Basically, I just don't like to put too many fingers on the fretboard at one time for this song. Because it creates more of a hassle as to where you're as to like the speed of the song because and plus like when the notes overlap it doesn't sound right so I advise you not to put too many fingers on at a time it'll slow you down just practice dexterity and such but uh, but so again it's open E 7th fret A 5th fret D uh, Six, fifth on the on the open E string. Uh, it's really simple. You're gonna play that 12 times through, and then there's a distortion pedal in there. Like you, like you can do it on electric. I just don't want to right now, but you can do it on electric and just hit the distortion pedal and, and turn it on, and then it'll distort it. Like I'll just give you the intro to the main part. Basically, you're gonna hit the when as soon as you end the intro riff, you're gonna hit the seventh and hit an open E power chord, like open E open with and then a second for an A, so it'd go and so on. But here for here's for my next video.